My opinion on Kane is that he's a former WWE Champion, World Heavyweight Champion, Tag Team Champion, ECW Champion, Money in the Bank winner. And he's one of the most dominating forces in the WWE. But I wonder where he went after Randy Orton went to the Wyatt family. Where did he go? He went to go run for mayor. Why? Why? Kane needs to return to the WWE. If not, he had no he had a legendary career. But I don't get why he would just drop drop out of WWE after getting attacked by Randy Orton. Many people have gotten attacked by Randy Orton and then they've still come back and they beat him. But Randy Orton's a good guy now. Why not just go back? Why not return to Raw, go find Bray Wyatt and beat him up? Yeah, I said it. Kane should go to Raw and beat up Bray Wyatt. He's the one who pretty much controlled Randy Orton through that time. So go after Bray Wyatt. It's not that hard. Drop whatever you're doing. Put on a mask. The mask. And go find Bray Wyatt on Monday Night Raw. I'm sure he's probably going to be in a creepy corner somewhere doing a promo. So go find him. Have a match. And go back to Raw. You've done it before. You can do it again. I don't care if you even turn me off. Go back to Raw. Go back to Raw. Kane is also a Money in the Bank briefcase holder. And he is also the man who buried The Undertaker alive. Yep. So, where is Kane? We probably all don't know. He's probably running for mayor somewhere. So, yeah. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And, uh, subscribe. And, yeah. Pe yeah, peace.